When you want to make a silky smooth puree at home and you only want to make a small amount, well, I've got a little trick up my sleeve. I use my all-in-one food processor from start to finish. So instead of cutting up the carrots, all I do is add a disc. So this is my shredding disc and I have it on course. We just pop the lid on and grate the carrot. So we are letting the food processor do all the work. We're just gonna take the coarse shredder out into the pan with our carrot. And to get some extra flavors into this, a little bit of butter, a little bit of cream, maybe one to two tablespoons of cream. And we can put a little bit of water in here, but by the time that butter melts down, it should be fine in regards to moisture. So pop the heat on. About a medium heat is good for this. And if you cook this in a traditional way, so big chunks of carrot, of course it's going to take half an hour. But if you're in a rush like I am today, by shredding it like this, it's only going to take 10. So 10 minutes and this is cooked and the best way to check just get one piece of that carrot and if it's just sort of falls apart between your fingers just like that it's ready to go so we're going to pop that directly into our food processor I'm changing to a quad blade because this will make the puree smooth so in goes our carrot mixture and look if you're being a little bit more health conscious by all means you can omit the cream and the butter and just use olive oil and water so that's a little tip also we're going to give that a good blitz until it's really fine and smooth ready to go, smooth, silky puree. And when you've got a small food processor like this, and you're doing a small amount, so I'm just doing enough for me today, this ensures that you don't get any lumps. So into a bowl, and this is fantastic, carrot puree like this, with a little bit of grilled duck, a little bit of fish, even with a little bit of lamb. Mm -hmm. 